P.T. Robel, and I will be the new upper school computer science teacher here at Latin. And you can find me in room 321. And uh, I guess a little bit of background about me. I am from Chicago. I went to Ignatius, which I know is terrible. Um, and I have background in math and computer science, and I'm very excited to be here. Um, so you mentioned that you're developing a new computer science class. Uh, can you talk a little bit about that process and, yeah, what you hope to see? Sure, that? sure. Uh, so I have a new class called CS Principles, or Computer Science Principles, and it'll be a year-long elective. It's open to anybody. Um, and it is a broad introduction to the field of computer science. It is not intended for people uh, necessarily to think of themselves as, like, computer people right away. It's for everybody. And I'm hoping that we get a wide variety of people who are interested. Um, so it'll be very project-based and very collaborative, and you won't always be on a computer. So I'm excited mm -hmm. for it. Um, and what sort of inspired you to develop this new curriculum? Um, so the reason we're choosing this is that we didn't want to teach what traditionally computer science looks like in high school. And the reason, I think, is that it can be a little pedantic, and so you spend a lot of time learning syntax, syntax for a programming language, and it's just less fun. So uh, it's hoping to give a really broad, strong foundation and allow a wide variety of students to explore the field, students who have some background can advance, and then move forward. Hopefully, we'll have more offerings in the future or in college, uh, people will pursue it further. Um, and then for students in the class, uh, some might wonder, what will the assessment sort of look like in a class sure. like this? So it's going to be primarily projects. Um, there won't be, the way I've laid it out, there probably won't be anything you would call a test. Um, quizzes, things like that. Uh, but I've set it out, and I'd be happy to talk to students about it more so that they can uh, build up the skills necessary to do like a project at the end of every unit. Um, I hope to be very clear about what those are supposed to look like and and then, is the class sort of starting at an introductory level, or should student, should incoming students have sort of a background knowledge? No expectation of background knowledge. We're literally starting, I hope I get a, a lot of students who can experience it, but we're starting square one. Uh, students with background knowledge, I think, can still gain a lot from it, and they should come talk to me, or they should just sign up anyway. Um, and if somebody happens to find themselves to be quite advanced, um, then I'm more than happy to talk about it. Um, and then finally, just to get a little to know you a little better, um, what's one thing people don't know about you that you think they should know? Uh, I am an avid cyclist. I love biking around the city, and I've done a little bit of bike touring. I hope to be going, if I get the wheels I want, up to Milwaukee next weekend by bike. So that's something. If you want to talk to me about bikes. <laughs> well, cool. Thank you so much.